John Lortzen shows us how three sisters have helped start an empire at the great Minnesota get-together. We look forward to it every year, you know, and this is kind of what our, our parents wanted, too. For more than 50 years, sisters Lou McCardell, Lori Rebar, and Lynn Meadows have been working at the Minnesota State Fair. It all began at Peter's Hot Dogs, which their great-grandfather essentially started. Then in 39, we started selling, actually it was hot dogs and lunch meat sandwiches for a nickel. Today, Lou and Lynn work long days in the food building, surrounded by employees who also happen to be family. There you are, enjoy. So we have six generations behind the stand right now. Lori was part of that crew too until the mid 80s. That's when she fell in love at the fair of all places. I met my husband out here at the fair in 77. In the back room of the Peters hot dog stand talking yeah. about college classes. Yeah. Lori. Lori and her husband Brad opened up another popular stand, the corn roast in 1985. The sisters now live in different cities. Lynn is in Mesa, Arizona. So the fair is the one time they're all together, selling food, playing pranks, and doing what they've done since they were kids, enjoying the great Minnesota get-together. Just being with everybody out here for all these years is really special. It's a family reunion for all of us, but it's also our fair family reunion. Yeah. I mean, we grew up with all these people out here, and, and they're all very close to your friends. At the Minnesota State Fair, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. In addition to Peter's hot dogs and the corn roast, Lori's son Matt has Duke's poutine stand and Lou's daughter runs another hot dog stand in the Kidway. What a legacy. How about that? Yeah, that's a family <laughs> that knows how to do the fair, right?